Plastic is found in virtually everything these days and thus there is an abundance of plastic waste that needs to be taken care of. Plastic is made of polyethylene, polyvinyl chloride and polystyrene. It takes from 15 to 1000 years to degrade. Of the million and million tons of plastic waste generated in the world, only a minute fraction can be recovered for recycling. This plastic waste ends up in landfills, beaches, rivers and oceans and contributes to such devastating problems as the Great Pacific Ocean Garbage Patch, a swirling vortex of garbage the size of a continent off the western coast of America where plastic outnumbers plankton. Here are some simple steps that we can take that will dramatically reduce the amount of plastic waste generated by us. Say no to straws. One of the easiest way to keep plastic out of the landfill is to refuse plastic straws whenever you order a coke or a smoothie. Use reusable produce bags. A single plastic bag can take thousand years to degrade. Purchase some reusable produce bags and help keep even more plastic out of the landfill. However, avoid those bags made from nylon or polyester because they are also made from plastic. Opt for cotton ones instead. Give up gum. Gum was originally made from tree sap called chicle, a natural rubber. But when scientists created synthetic rubber, polyethylene and polyvinyl acetate began to replace the natural rubber in most gum. While it is possible to recycle your gum, it may be best to skip it and its plastic packaging altogether. Use matchsticks. When you need to light a candle, build a campfire or start a fire or for any other reason, opt for matches over disposable plastic lighters. These cheap plastic devices sit in landfills for years and have been found in the stomach of dead birds. Reuse glass containers. You can buy a variety of prepared food in glass jars instead of plastic ones, including spaghetti sauce, peanut butter, clarified butter, jams, pickles, etc., just to name a few. Instead of throwing these away or recycling them, reuse the jars to store food. Buy boxes, not bottles. Buy laundry detergent and dish soap in boxes instead of plastic bottles. Cardboard can be more easily recycled and made into more products than plastic. Use reusable bottles and cups. By simply refilling a reusable plastic bottle, which we all use quite often, you will prevent some of these plastic bottles from ending up in landfills and oceans. But don't stop there. Bring a reusable cup to coffee shops and ask the barista to fill it up and keep a mug at your desk instead of using plastic, paper or styrofoam cups. In the departmental store, skip the frozen foods section. Frozen foods offer both convenience and plenty of plastic packaging. Even those eco-friendly packaged items made from cardboard are actually coated in a thin layer of plastic. While giving a frozen food can be difficult, there are benefits besides the obvious environmental ones. You'll be eating fewer processed foods and avoiding the chemicals in the plastic packaging. Don't use plasticware. Say goodbye to disposable chopsticks knives, spoons and forks. If you often forget to pack silverware in your lunch or if you know your favorite restaurant has plasticware, start keeping a set of utensils. It's sure to reduce your carbon footprint. Return reusable containers. If you buy mushrooms or strawberries at the farmer's market, simply bring the plastic containers to the market when you need a refill. 
You can even ask your local grocer to take the containers back and reuse them. Use cloth diapers. It nearly takes pounds of plastic and innumerable trees a year to manufacture disposable diapers for babies. By simply switching to cloth diapers, you will not only reduce a baby's carbon footprint, you will also save money. Don't buy juice bottles and packs. Instead of buying juice in plastic bottles and tetra packs, make your own freshly squeezed juice or simply eat fresh fruit. Not only does this cut down on plastic waste, but it's also better for you because you will be getting more vitamins and antioxidants and less high fructose corn syrup. Bring your own container. Whether you're picking up takeaway or bringing home your restaurant leftovers, be prepared with your own reusable containers. When you place your order, ask if you can get the food placed in your own container. They won't have any problem with it. There's no need for multiple plastic bottles of tile cleaner, toilet cleaner and window cleaner if you have a few basics on hand, like baking soda and vinegar. So free up some space, save some cash and avoid those toxic chemicals by making your own cleaning products. Pack a lunch the right way. Instead of packing snacks and sandwiches in bags, put them in reusable containers you have at home or try lunch accessories like reusable snack bags. Online shopping has given rise to the use of plastic packaging materials extensively. You can return these materials to the vendor for reuse. It is possible to eliminate plastic in daily life, but it's prudent for a health and that of environment to curb the use of some. Overall reduction in plastic usage, proper management for disposal and public awareness would bring a great difference in present situation. Separate, store and hand over for recycling or disposal. Do not let plastic litter the environment. Thus it all depends on us as how we manage it.